Hello. It's a beautiful day right here in Nigeria. Today is South Thursday, and it's a wonderful day here. God bless you for being part of today's broadcast in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, I think I'm fully back now. Am I fully back? I'm back. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, um, there's this particular video my, one of my sisters sent to me um, some days ago uh, about a particular woman that came out and said um, uh, people are worshipping uh, Prophet T.B. Joshua and something. I don't just know why people have issue with Prophet T.B. Joshua. I don't just understand. Because this is very logical and very critical. This is barbaric. This is sentimental. If my problem is if people, there are a lot of people that are worshipping your pastors, your own pastors, your daddy Jews, your big mega, you won't see, nobody will say that, you say it's a respect. But people respecting Prophet Tim and the anointing, people regarding that anointing and grace to you now, out of your hatred, jealousy and envy, because this can only come out of envy and jealousy. You are now saying we are worshipping him, we are doing this, we are doing that. But that same you will bow down and, and greet your pastor. That same you will lie down on the floor and greet your general of us. And we are not complaining. We have never one day come to say, don't worship such a person. Don't worship this person. Don't do this and don't do that. What is you guys' problem with Prophet T.B. Joshua? I understand that you have not seen anything like that before. What I mean, anything like that, whatever God has been using them to do, you have not seen anything like that in your life. I know that the, the origin of all this thing is confusion because you guys are just tired. You don't understand how a man will touch somebody instantly and the healing will come without making noise and he's, he's, he's gone. He's, he's out there. He will touch demon, will run away. In, in less than five seconds, 10 people are healed and 10 people are delivered. You have not seen something like that before. Even without opening his mouth to say anything. People are being healed. His shadow is healing people. He's present. Even the day this person man died and he was buried during the, during the um, uh, uh, how do they call it, the line state, people were still healed and delivered the same day. Up till now, men will touch his, um, his uh, picture and they'll be healed. I know this way the whole confusion is coming up. But can you guys just rest? Because nothing will change. You guys have fought this man for more than 30 years. Even in death, you are still fighting him. What man of man is still relevant even after death? I, I want to be like this man. I cannot die irrelevant in this life. I will be relevant and life and be relevant in death. I have seen something in my generation and it has become a target in my life. In this life, may a man can be relevant when he's alive and can still be even more relevant when he's gone. That's exactly how Prophet T. B. Joshua is. And that's why none of you can sleep. When you sleep and say, ah, this man, this man, we need to do something, we need to say. But you know, the more you talk about him, the more our faith grows, the more you will know more. Now you have told us that people are watching, it means that we have so much people, uh, so many sons and daughters that respect the anointing, that respect even when this man is not alive. Thank you for the updates. You don't give us updates now. <laughs> All right, guys. So, Please, I've watched the video. I know you guys, may, none of you guys were waiting for me to talk about it. I've watched the video. It's nothing anywhere. It's just jealousy and envy. There's no prophecy there. Nothing will happen. They have been given, they have given prophecies upon prophecies to that church. And nothing has happened because if it's not from God, it will never manifest. It may not be part at all. It may not be part at all. Of course, you know that. If you're Nigerian, you got the gigs. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Have beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day ahead. Good morning and win forever.